This video will walk you through the process of training course creation. Training courses represent a series of lessons organized in training steps. Each step can contain a test and attachments, which are training course materials for learning. To create a training course, navigate to the main menu and click the New Training Course button. Enter the name and optionally a description. Navigate to the Steps tab and click the Add Step button to start building your training course. Enter the name and optionally a description. Training steps are the stages that a candidate needs to pass to complete the training course. Each step may contain one of the nine types of attachments that can be imported as a file or inserted as a link. Also, you can import files from the library. Click on Settings and choose Add Attachment from the drop-down menu. Enter the name, optionally a description, and select Attachment Format. Upload a file or insert a link and click the Save button to confirm changes. Repeat this process for all other course materials and note, you may add as many steps and course materials to each as you require. UTestment Get Certified supports various types of images, audio and video files, PDF documents, Google Docs, zip files, and external links. To test the candidate's knowledge, you can add a test after each lesson or at the end of the training course. Click on the Add Test and from the drop-down menu, choose the existing one or quickly create ad hoc, a test whose testing session is created automatically but can only be a part of a training course. To add an existing one, click on the Assign in the Actions column. To enroll candidates in the training course, navigate to Candidates tab and click on the Assign Candidates button. You may choose between all users in the system or from the groups. Tick the boxes next to the candidates you want to assign to the training session and click Confirm to save the changes. If the training course contains a test, it is essential to create a testing session so the assigned candidate can take it. Navigate back to Steps tab and click on the test. Go over to the Testing Session tab and click on the New Testing Session button. Enter the session name, choose Availability Dates, and assign the test to the created training course. This way, candidates enrolled in the training course will be automatically assigned to this testing session. Only after the candidate goes through all training steps and passes the tests, the candidate will complete the training course. To publish a training course, navigate to the Training Courses tab. Go to Drafts and select your training course. Click on the Publish button.